Hello, and welcome to this presentation, Understanding Torque Wrenches. In this presentation, we'll provide a short overview of torque wrenches and how they're used with radio frequency connectors. There are many different types of connectors used in radio frequency applications, the most common of which are Type N and SMA. There are several reasons why it's important to properly tighten these connectors. The first is that a properly tightened connection helps to ensure accurate and repeatable measurements. Many RF measurement issues can be traced back to improperly tightened connectors. Proper connector tightening also reduces wear on connectors and helps to extend their useful life. And good connection procedure is essential in avoiding damage to connectors. In some cases, finger tightening of the connector may be sufficient, but the proper connection methodology requires the use of a special torque wrench. Note that normal wrenches should never be used on radio frequency connectors, since these can very easily cause damage due to over torquing. There are two general categories of torque wrenches used for RF connectors. Break or breakover wrenches, which are by far the most common, and twist type wrenches. Let's take a look at each of these type of wrenches, starting with brake type. Brake or breakover style wrenches are the most common type of torque wrench. When using these kinds of wrench, the head will break or fold over when the wrench's torque limit is reached. Note that there are wrenches in which this braking action is internal, and these produce a clicking noise instead. The proper method of using brake style torque wrenches is to only turn the wrench until the head just slightly breaks, as shown here. After this initial break, the wrench should not be further turned until the head stops or locks. Twist type wrenches are much less common than brake style wrenches. These types of wrenches are available in various sizes and form factors, but they typically have a half-open flange at one end that interfaces with a connector, and a half-open tube in which the end of the cable can rest during torquing. Some of these wrenches are just a simple mechanical adapter that require the attachment of an external torque wrench, as shown here, while others may have a torque limiting mechanism integrated into their handle. These types of wrenches are primarily used when there's insufficient room for a brake type wrench. For example, in the case of a switch matrix with a large number of densely spaced RF ports. Two parameters are used to specify torque wrenches. The first is the torque limit, which is often shown as Newton meters, but may also be expressed in pound inches. The second is the nut or opening size in millimeters or inches. Naturally, these specifications are different for different RF connector types, such as N, SMA, etc. In order to ensure that they provide the proper torque, wrenches require calibration. This is usually done by the manufacturer, but in some cases, torque wrenches may be delivered uncalibrated. The accuracy of a torque wrench is expressed as plus or minus X percent, and wrenches with very high accuracy are sometimes referred to as metrology grade. As you might expect, the cost of torque wrenches is often a function of their accuracy. Let's end with a brief summary. Properly tightening RF connectors has two major advantages. First, it helps to ensure accurate, repeatable measurements, especially for demanding or sensitive applications. And it also helps to reduce wear and tear and the risk of damage to the connectors, which in turn extends the connector's useful life. Special torque wrenches can be used to apply the correct amount of torque for a given connector type. There are two main categories of torque wrenches, brake or breakover wrenches, which are by far the most common, and twist style wrenches, which are useful in tight spaces. Regardless of type, torque wrenches are specified by both their opening size and their torque limit. The accuracy of this limit is indicated as a percentage with higher quality and higher cost wrenches typically having much higher accuracy. This concludes our presentation, Understanding Torque Wrenches. If you'd like to learn more about RF connectors, connector care, or RF test and measurement instruments from Rodian Schwartz, please see the links in the video description. 
Thanks for watching.